So can I count on you? One last time. All right, kid. Let's go do it. One last time. Hey guys, welcome back to 50 Days of Drake. We are officially in the 30s, people. It is day 39, and I am so excited. I can't wait. We're getting closer and closer. Today, well, today is the 30th. Uh, so I'm recording this day before I'm going to upload it. And today was like the last episode of Naughty Dog's, I guess, retrospective on Uncharted 4. Uh, you know, it's a short series on the PlayStation YouTube channel. You should really watch it because it, I was literally like tearing, crying. I was literally crying watching it. It is so... Oh my god, it is like breaking my heart that this story is over. And you could tell it is breaking their heart as well. So you know they put everything they had into the series. And it's going to be so amazing. They're talking about like the last epic jump scene in it. And it just looks amazing. And I, I can't wait to see it. I can't wait to play it. And I can't wait to talk to you guys about it. But let's get on with this retrospective of our own. And we're on day 39 so let's finish up with uncharted 2 we'll talk about some stuff that's happening now him and tenzin are go about to go into the ice caves so let's see what happens there <sighs> let's hope there's another way out of here there were no cutscenes in the ice caves. What I think there was. Tell a shot. This must be them. Schaefer's expedition. They are dead oh. as fuck. <laughs> and that is the resin, my friend, my friends. Chintamani stone. Huh. Nate's not making the connection yet, but he will. Hello. Well, that's kind of what you get this. for being a Nazi, so. No sympathy there. <laughs> I love how the shot. two of them communicate. It's just brilliant. I think I spoke about it in the last video. How you you were in the same boat as Nate is when you're trying to figure out how to talk to Tenzin and how to communicate with him. Oh, Jesus. They were SS. Mm. Nazis. Everybody knows Nazis. In any language, unfortunately. He's starting to get a creepy feeling now. He's starting to put the pieces together. A little, little bit. What would a man become? Now, not for anything. The one question I always had with, with these... Tenzin. Monsters, whatever they are, these. Schaefer killed them. I forget what they're called. Why can't I think of what they're called? Um, it's the only way to stop. But they're, you know, the blue dudes. <laughs> That's the official name, the blue dudes. Why are they, they are so scary on their own? Why are, do they have to dress up in costumes? I never understood that. I mean, this, they they look like the Yetis. I know, but they're wearing a costume to look like a Yeti. But they're so freaking scary all on their own why would they put on a costume does that make sense it never made sense to me um but whatever you know i mean let me know what you think about that did you guys always have a problem with that or did you just like accept it and say oh okay this was just to throw everyone off i know they're scarecrows you know and they're supposed to but i mean they don't need any help scaring anybody because they are Swole as fuck. They are huge, and I wouldn't want to mess with any of them. Costume, no, no costume, blue or no blue. <laughs> you okay? Oh. Tenzin, I love Tenzin and his little family. Oh, no, Tenzin. This is such an epic so battle. Sweet. This whole part. And then the tank. Oh, I could. I love this part. 
And I, I tell you, the um, the bow in this game is so satisfying. I don't know. I don't. I love how it's a one-hit kill and it's perfect stealth weapon. I love it. Schaefer and Young Dudo. Schaefer, they went the other way. Nate, this is our fault. We did Elena, teach teach me some Tibetan, please, so I can understand him. Come on. See, now I understand because I was talking to my experts. Um, I think it's for you and Phantom of Vanitas. I think that's how you say it. Um, we're always like commenting about, you know, like the theories and stuff like that. So shout out to my boys. Um, just wanted to, you know, let you know we were talking about this with, um, with the, I was talking, I, I don't know if it was yesterday's episode or the day before about the post-it note with, that says Schaefer on it, that, um, Lazarevich was on the trail of, um, of Schaefer's and I oh, I never noticed that I just always thought that that's where he followed Marco Polo's trail and he just happened to cross Schaefer because Schaefer was on the down low because he was trying to keep this whole thing under wraps and a secret so that's what I thought but now Nate just says no this is you know Elena says we did this this is our fault it's it's really not so I I kind of feel a strange sense of relief that this whole battle and that all those people died wasn't my fault. It wasn't Drake's fault, actually, I should say, because it was really Schaefer. I mean, not Schaefer, but Lazarevich knew about Schaefer, so he was coming for him no matter what, if Nate showed up or if he didn't show up. So, side so note, I always felt really guilty about that, that I came and started all this hot mess and, you know, guns and, and guns blazing and brought Schaefer upon us. So, we didn't. He was going there anyway, whether we were there or not. So it makes me feel a little, a little bit better about all those people in the town dying, you know. So, so shout out to my boys oh, and my other my people God. out there who's leaving great comments about theories and everything. You guys are so awesome. It's so nice to talk to people who like really get it and who really love this series. So thank you for that and keep these awesome comments coming because it's amazing. It's making the series so much better. Shiver, big guy. Holy shit! Oh crap! Jump! That jump! Jump! <laughs> no. Oh. What's jump in Tibetan? And cat and mouse. This is chapter twenty, if I remember correctly. And this is how much I play this. Like seriously. I I have a problem. <laughs> Schaefer, where's Schaefer? We come Schaefer still. Yay, the babies are okay. They took Schaefer. Oh. After watching Michonne yesterday, I don't think I could take. Uh, after playing the Michonne, uh, the Walking Dead series yesterday, I don't think I could have handled any more bad news about children. Hey, no time to argue. We gotta go. All right. Oh, please scooch over. Okay. Aww. We'll be back, I promise. Oh, hugs. All right, they must have taken him in the lead car. We gotta stop him before Lazarevich gets a hold of him. All right, uh -oh. I have an idea. I'm gonna oh, jump out of this truck doing? while it's moving. <laughs> Here, take the wheel. Oh what? Just take it. Why didn't you just let me drive in the first place? <laughs> is that where the wheel's supposed to be? I mean, ahead. I don't know yeah. how it is. I know in, you know, like in Europe, you drive on the other Hold side of the road okay. and the steering wheel's on the other side of the car, but this is in America, it's on the left side? But where they are, it's on the left side, so it's weird. I don't know. I don't know if that's just like, you know, something they missed or if it really is. Who knows? Now I'm, now I'm really nitpicking about, like, uh, the stuff. No, I was just curious. I wasn't even trying to hate on it. <laughs> you okay back there? Yeah. There's the lead car. Got it. Hold on. Ah, that's right, you bastards. We got you now. Oh, crap. Duck. <laughs> oh, my God. How did they survive that? I will never know. Let's go. But like, why wouldn't you check? <laughs> That's typical, you know, hero movie trope, I guess. Enemy trope. 
They couldn't possibly survive that. No need to check. Come on. I love the monastery chapter too. It's so great. Just like old times, huh? I love using that? the dragon sniper. So now what? Trying to take out the towers. How awesome is that? Look how beautiful that is. And this was we 2009, the people. Creepy old monastery. What else? <laughs> They're Schaefer. Oh, Damn this it. guy's like a hundred. Come What's on. Happening? Lazarvish has him. Oh no. Well, they knew, oh. yeah. You ready for this? They know he's not going to survive that, so. As I'll ever be. I like the part, I, I don't know if it's in the cutscene or if it's in the actual gameplay, when they're climbing up, they're trying to sneak up on them. And Elena goes first, and he's like, yeah, nice view. He's, she's like, really? <laughs> it's got like a nice view of her butt. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, drink. Okay. Everything you do touch here. turns to shit. You are right. About what? Everything you touch does turn to shit. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Right, come on. We're gonna get you out of here. No. What do we do? Did you find my expedition? Yes, I found them. You yes, understand we believe what you. I we know. <laughs> yes. If they had found the stone, it would have changed the course of history. <laughs> okay, easy. Easy. He took the dagger. I know. They He's always make interesting the characters in this movie, even if they're in it for a short it. time. Try, you know, like he wasn't move. in this movie. In this movie. This, in this uh, ep you must get the dagger back. Part two, Find too long. This is part of the uh, series, the but you like he him. His hands on it. Drake. You his have eyebrows are insane, be. though. He needs to trim the oh. Schaefer. Oh my oh, god. Wait. That's that that's not normal. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> we can't just leave him. What choice do we have? You heard him. Alright, P Schaefer. Really could be true? I don't know. But he believed it. That's enough for me. That's good enough for me. Okay. I think we should split up. What? No, listen. I'll go scope out the guy. secret entrance thing, and you go to the tower and figure out how to get that dagger back. He wouldn't leave anyone hanging like that, especially like their last yeah, wish. All right. Just God, I just had this horrible down. feeling, guys. I don't Stay know. Really I don't know contact. about you, but yeah. Okay. How strongly do you feel like good one luck. of our main characters are gonna die? Do you think it's gonna be Sully? Do you think it's gonna be Nate? The only reason why I don't think Sam is going to die because they showed it on that the 30 second uh, trailer that Nate's trying to grab him and he falls twice. There's two there's two 30 second spots where one where he's trying to catch Sam and Sam, you don't know if he catches him or not. Like, you know, it's the end of the 30 second spot. So you don't really know. The second one, he falls and he's trying to catch him, but he, he's falling. So I don't think they would ever put that in the game like it's canon that he dies only because they kind of showed it. So I don't, I don't know. I'm so like running in circles, trying to think so much about what they're going to show, what, what's going to, what's going to be, what's going to happen. So I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine, but I'm going to end this episode here today. I'm going to, um, come back tomorrow with day 38. I hope you guys are liking these, um, episodes. I'm so, so enjoying doing them i love doing them for you guys and i'm so happy for all the love and support you guys have been showing me so thanks for everything please keep liking and liking and subscribing i have not been keeping up with instagram this was a crazy week like this was nuts i put up three episodes yesterday um so i'm playing catch up this last couple days so between easter and atlantic city so i'm gonna make sure everybody's got their content coming up tomorrow so Thanks so much for watching and sticking around, guys. I really appreciate it. Thanks so much.